Hi guys and welcome back. Today I will be reviewing some Briar Classic Collection models. So today I went to my local Tuesday morning and I found this beautiful board for only $9.99. I love that Tuesday morning has very discounted prices for Briars. I just think it's absolutely amazing. So now let's unbox this boy. And now he has been taken out of his box. When I was taking him out of his box, I got this really, really cute catalog that I'm going to look at later on. And as you can see on this model, he has a very, very rich shade of chestnut on him that I think looks really, really nice. But I think my favorite part of all is his Appaloosa blanketed butt. I think it's really cute how on his right side, the blanket is shorter than it is on the left side. You can see that the two differences, but I still think it looks really, really nice. I think the pattern complements the model really well, and I just think Appaloosa is so great. And as you can see, he has two stockings in the front and none in the back. And now we can move on to his face. As we can see, his really, really gorgeous face, he has a stripe down his face, and I just think this face is just so adorable. And I love how they added the whites to the eyes to give this model a more realistic look. And that's the chestnut Appaloosa. And now on to the buckskin paint. So as you guys can see, I already took the liberty of unboxing this guy. And as you guys can see, I love his pattern so much. I love Pintos and Paints. They're just one of my favorite horses. And I love how the coloring is just so great. I love how that back leg has the white really, really high. And just the stockings are really nice and crazy. And I love love this mold i love the running pose and as we can see his cute cute face we can see that he has a star on his forehead which i think is really cute and his face is just super cute and this model just in general is super cute we can see on this side we can see that he has a dorsal stripe and we can see the rest of his white paint and then we can see on his back leg that the white is actually lower but still overall very very cute and one of my favorites And now we're on to the gray cell from set. I hope I said that right, because <laughs> that's the name. So I hope I really do hope I said it right. So as you guys can see, this mare has a really, really nice shade of gray. Of course, it's not white, but it's gray because that's the name um, of the real breed that they're after, the gray, the gray cell. But as you guys can see, she has some really, really nice highlights. And you can see the darker sprays in her hair, which looks really nice. And also in her tail, you can see the quite ombre of the dark gray to the white, where I think is really cool. And in the back, she has some high stockings. And in the front, she doesn't. But I still think it's pretty, pretty cute. And what I really like about this model is that she is a really chunky girl. I love that she's thick. <laughs> so I just think that's really, really cute on her. And now we're on to her face. As you guys can see, she has a little tiny snip on her muzzle, which is pretty cute. And she also has the eye whites, which I like. And then you guys can see that on the other side, she has this little piece of hair, which is really, really cute. And this is the back of her, and that is the gray cell Francais. And that's the video for today. Thank you guys so much for sticking around to the end. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel, which will mean the world to me. And don't forget to leave a comment down below and share this video with your other horse loving friends. Thank you guys so much for watching. See you in the next one. Bye guys.